I moved to New York in the 90s, and I still have a place in New York. I love New York. If somebody asked me, where are you from? I'd say New York, not Missouri. This place is a mess. I got to get in here and start cleaning stuff up. I don't even know where to begin. Well, yeah, I do. I, st I started cleaning up front here. I know it's back there. I know how far, I know how thick it is. There's a lot of stuff I need to get rid of. There's some, most of it's art, but some of it got destroyed. Like, see, I wouldn't get rid of Rudolph and Abe. I mean, that, that piece is not running, but it very easily could. It's, it's, it's not working. It hasn't ran in years, but I, I could get that running if I wanted to. Like, if the Whitney called me. Yeah, sure, I can, I can get that piece going. Sure. The, the Hessian, well, the Hessian soldier back there, he needs to be cleaned up. Then our, our patriot here, James Madison, he could still pee, but he doesn't have a, you know, he doesn't have a wean on, but he could. I could, see, See, he, would st he was standing up, and then the Hessian soldier back there has a cannonball hole in his gut. And then the James Madison here, he was, he was peeing on the red coat. You know, war's, war's a bitch. It is. It's it's a it's a fucking bitch. And you get you get that mentality going. Same thing in New York City. You you know you you it's us against them. We're gonna win. And then you have people that are clearly have weapons. People, you know, it's like ma mass hysteria. They start doing things that they they never, you know, look at World War Two. But this is called every cop's fantasy. I made it. I made it right after that Abner Loema thing happened. And the, the white punk cop is putting a plunger up the black cop, the cartoonish looking black cops, Peanut and Corn Highway. That was a totally violent act. They did that in the bathroom at the police station to that guy. Absolutely. They raped him. The cops raped him. Here's the money shot. Most of my life, I've lived in New York, New York City, and I've I had some really good experiences there, and I still I still have the place. I'm going back, but I had some bad experiences too, and and they are similar to experiences that other people have had in this country, and that's that's regarding the police, and nothing nothing really bad happened to me. Not, you know, they'd pull me over, they'd see me, and then they'd want to search me because I, I was told by a cop it was because it, I was on a bicycle and I'm skinny, so they assumed that I'm a drug addict. I've made art about all the presidents, probably. I'm sure. Um, can't think of one that I haven't. Maybe Taft? Certainly I must have made a piece on Taft. He was a fat fucker. Yeah. Yes. McKinley. Yeah, I've made art about McKinley. I've made art about all the presidents. I have Abe Lincoln in here. Ron, Re Ron Reagan's inside. Um, of course, Trump. There's a lot of Trump sculptures at my studio. All of the presidents. And recently I, I figured out how to do Photoshop. I could do some things on Photoshop, but not much. I didn't know how to cut stuff out and move it. That's what I just figured out in the last 48 hours, which is a big deal because I always wanted to be able to do it, but I didn't know how. I didn't know how to do that. So that's great. So I started making these, these collage works. That's Bigfoot. There's definitely, that's Patterson's Bigfoot. And some people had a problem with this one. I'm not really sure why. I think it's rather uplifting. 
and I'm using the, you know, as a subject, I, I use the president we have right now. I'll tell you, a, a bunch of big babies, they can't handle seeing Trump in, you know, art. It's just like they, 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 they turn into snowflakes. Like Trump. Trump's king of the snowflakes. Like it's art. What, what, what's your problem? They're saying, I'm going to unsubscribe to your channel. Oh, okay. Like I care. Like is, is that the only power you have is like to say that you're going to unsubscribe? Does that make you feel better? Because you don't like the art that I made about the president that you support, but most of the country doesn't. Oh, George Bush is on the ground here. That, that, that's, that's George Bush right there. That's terrible. That's disrespectful. That is. That's an alien that George Bush was, um, you know, having to do things to right there with his mouth. That's an alien. George Bush is on the ground. See, he, would, he was kneeling in front of the alien because somebody's going to have to do it. And he was president at, at the time. So the alien said, hey, we want somebody to give us... A rimmer. The president. It's it's it w it was his job to do it. It wasn't it wasn't my it wouldn't be my job to do it. George, go down on the alien for us, please. Trump Trump won't do anything for us like that. There's no way. He is not gonna be helpful. He's not, he's not gonna do anything unless it's in his best interest. That's what it's all about. But, I mean, the, the amount of s subject matter on presidents is vast. I have a whole body of work that has to do with that. You name it. I have several Abe Lincoln pieces just in this barn. George Washington. Of course I'm going to do D Donald Trump. He's a maniac. It's just ridiculous. It isn't just Donald Trump and Melania that I have in compromising positions. It's, it's a lot of politicians. I have a couple of the popes in here. It's politicians, uh, religious figures. But I mean, I don't, I, you know, it's, it's not like I, I put Donald Trump in any more of a compromising uh, position, him and his wife, than I would Obama or George Washington or anybody. Well, wait a minute. I did have Donald Trump having sex with a sheep. He's sucking his own dick. Yeah, that's 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 the worst. That that's sort of like the the most I've ever like really like made it clear that somebody is sort of the scum of the earth. That's how I sort of see it, that, that, that piece, like that, that whole show was about that, like, how could you pick this man? That was right when, when he got elected. How could, you, how could you have picked this man? That's what that show was about. He's horrible. And I use these metaphors that are just like horrible, horrible, to say how horrible I, I think that he is going to be as president. And the, seriously... I probably should have tried to make it more horrible. Absolutely. Just having him doing a watermelon? No, no way. No way. This guy's really been bad. He's been bad. So the artwork's gonna, gonna say it. And if I have him and Melania standing in front of a mushroom cloud, that's pretty much where we're at. Don't you think? It's not going well. It has not gone well at all. Unless you talk about, you know, finances. It, it, went, it went pretty good for everybody, didn't it? Because you, we had that, the Obama effect. Obama's the one that got the stock market moving. Donald Trump inherited that great stock market. What do we have here? It's another president. It's George Washington. However... It's George Washington, 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 Washington. It's George, right, from Washington, D.C. 
And what's he have in his hand? It's Barbara Bush's head. And of course, he's wearing Barbara Bush's dress. That isn't George Washington. That's the robotic. That's the robot George Washington that may come back from the future. Now, this does turn on. This, this, I turned it on just recently, but there's no power out here right now. It's, it's George Washington. Well, that's not me. Somebody said that that was me, and I'm like, really? That doesn't look like George? Isn't this like the tri-corner hat, whatever? Isn't that sort of like the blue dress? That, that was classic, absolutely classic Barbara Bush. She always wore a blue dress like that. Grandma. This right here was the body of the painter Bob Ross. Right here. His head is inside. And the smoked ham that he was, well, you know. He had it in his hands, the smoked ham. It's down there on the ground. It's Bob Ross. It's authentic. Authentic military gear, sort of. I hate these stabs. I need to put a handrail on here. Here's a piece from a long time ago. This went in a installation, and it was an installation of a priest with a, a kid in his lap. That was at Exit Art reading a, a book, like a Pinocchio book. And I, may, I made it because there was like all, the, all this bullshit we're hearing about priests and, and kids and shit. I'm like, what the fuck? Why don't, why don't they let like priests get married? Maybe you would have like a different crop of people. Um, I don't know, make, make, make it more options if you want to have the church. That's what I was talking about. Like, why is, why is it that only... I don't know. It, se it seems like the Catholic Church. I'm, I'm not going to say anything, but I mean, the past, I mean, they were just like covering for each other and just horrible, just horrible shit. Why, 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 can, why can't they be married? I've made work about Santa Claus several times. Several. I, I don't know, man. Maybe a lot, a lot. Santa Claus, sure. Santa Claus is ridiculous. It is. It's a man in a giant ice cube. It's a long story. I need to I need to clean up in here. This place is a freaking mess. There's an Indian over there. Uh-oh. An Indian? Isn't that racist? People are idiots. They are. They are. It looks like a sort of, it's, um, it's wrapped. I didn't unwrap it, but it sort of looks like a cigar store Indian, similar.